Hey guys, it's Melvin7 here. Today I'm bringing you episode 4 of my Manchester United Football Manager career mode. As you can see, in the last episode we had a very, very good episode. I uh, think we were unbeaten bar a Captain 1 Cup exit against Southampton. But in the league, we've climbed up to 5th. We're only 2 points away from 4th and we're only 7 points off the lead. Considering where we were, that is actually very good. So our first game today is against Wolfsburg in the Champions League. We're doing well in that as well. Um, so... Hopefully we can keep up our consistency. Uh, let's see, auto pick this team at the minute. Right, we're definitely going to give Chris Smalling a rest, I think. He definitely needs one. Um, we're also going to give Herrera a bit of a rest, and I think Rooney to have a rest as well. Um, mm, Dilly Blind is kind of... Mm. Now we'll leave it at that. I think that's uh, fair enough. We've got control on the game. Yeah, we'll, we'll use this formation as well. Yeah, I think I think this one's all right. Um, and yeah, we'll go with that. Hopefully we can win, and then that would put us in. Well, basically we'd be qualified, wouldn't we? With three games left, which is uh, very good, or we'd be close anyway. So go out and carry on from where you left off last game. We had a big win, I believe. And yeah, let's see what happens. Right, come on, that's a good ball, matter. Memphis, can you do anything? Oh, you went for the shot. First real chance of the game. Right. This is another chance for us. We've put it out wide to Dormy and it's back to Carrick. And we're doing some passing, but it's back out to Dormy. And on the wing, he's crossed it in. And that's unlucky. That's unlucky. Right, it's half time. Not much has happened, so I've decided to change um, not any subs, but the formation. So we're playing a 4 3 two, uh, 1 2. We've obviously got Matter in the hole, and Memphis has been pushed up top with Marcia. Let's see what that does. Right, Fellini couldn't quite get that through, but can matter. Yes, he can. That's a good touch by Martial, and that is why I've moved Memphis up uh, up front alongside Martial. Brilliant play, good assist, and good finish there. Well done, lads. We've got another chance here, and it's Carrick this time. It's 2-0. This formation change seems to have done the business, and, uh, yeah, maybe we can sit back a little bit. We'll lower the tempo, and, uh, yeah, that should be all right. We've got another chance here. It's Marcial. He's been tackled. Can Schweinsteiger retain possession? He can. Is this actually a chance? I think it might be. That's good. It's back into Memphis. Can he... he he's shot. He probably shouldn't have, but we're two nil up. I'm not really that bothered. This might be actually another highlight, because it's not quite the 92nd minute, so... Have we got another chance here? I've subbed on Young. I've also subbed on Blind, I think, on the other side. Give the fullbacks a little bit of a rest. Seems as though it might be a chance. Martial, can he put it in? He can. That's 3-0. What a route. What a way to complete. Well, it looks as though we're qualified for the Champions League. And we've qualified in style by the looks of this. So I'm very happy with the performance. 3-0. Well done, lads. Right. An imperative game against Liverpool. We cannot lose this at Anfield. So I've decided to go with a similar formation. I've only made a couple of changes. We've got Wayne Rooney in there. Juan Mata is feeling a bit tired. So I've decided to try something. I'm putting Martial out on the right. See what it does. So we've got pace on the wings with Rooney in the middle. Obviously that midfield hasn't changed from last game I don't think. Or did I bring in Schneidlin for Fellaini? think that might be the difference but anyway let's go all I care about is three points all right there's no excuses for not getting it it's Liverpool they're 13th we're fifth come on let's break into the top four first chance looks as though it's going to be Liverpool's just off the post thank fuck for that Right, similarly to what I did against Wolfsburg, I've changed the formation to a 4-3-1-2. Going to keep it, uh, the mentality is control. I haven't made any subs yet, but I've got a couple of, you know, things in my head that I might do. But is this an early goal? It is. The change has paid off out of all the people. It's fucking Phil Jones. A great Rooney ball in there. And Phil Jones manages to get on the end of that to make it 1-0 Manchester United. Have we got another chance here? Shaw, Memphis, Shaw again, <laughs> Schneidlin, Shaw, Memphis, it's 2-0, that should be game over, get in. Have we got another chance here to make it a route, it's Wilson who have just subbed on to Memphis and that perhaps should be three, but again, not really going to complain as long as we get the win. 
some good play. I've subbed on Wilson. What can he do? He's had a shot. Jürgen Klopp said he was the weak link in my team, so it would be adding salt into the wounds if he did score. But to be honest, 2 0 will do me. And I think that's how it's going to finish. Unless they get a late goal here, which doesn't really look too likely. It's usually one of these things that happens on FM. They just show the last 20 seconds. Can you just end the game? There we go. A nice, solid 2 0 win against Liverpool. I'm delighted. Um, we beat City, didn't we, in the last episode. Now we've beat Liverpool, so we've came good in the big games. We are now fourth, and we're still seven points off the top, but we're two points off third place Chelsea. We're definitely improving after that slump that we had at the start of the season. <laughs> Phil Jones, man of the match, oh my God. But yeah, let's continue this form, lads. We've got a week break, so that should improve the fitness in that. So yes, come on. Right, a game against Sunderland now, and I'm not changing too much. I think the defence is the same. We've brought in Bastian Schweinsteiger, though he's back from injury. And, uh, yeah, we're also playing the, the same kind of players, but just a slightly different system. The 4-2-4 wide this time, attacking. We're at home against Sunderland. It's got to be done. And, yeah, hopefully we can wi win by a good margin as well. We haven't conceded in a while. That's something I haven't pointed out. But, yeah, we've done very well not to concede, so hopefully we can do that again. And get a, a good win again. Right, first chance of the game. It's Martial and he, he's a bit unlucky there. That was a good ball through though. Got another chance here to show out to Schweinsteiger. What can he do? Passes it back to Jones. Man of the match in the last game. Show Memphis. Oh, that's brilliant. Martial 1-0 just before half time. Good time to score. Get in, lads. Right, we've got another chance here. Come on, Martial. Ooh. Try to go it alone, almost paid off. Oh shit, no, no, no. Oh, get in, this might actually be a breakaway. Rooney, what a ball that is. Marcel's managed to get it. Can he get it in? No, he can't. Van Aanholt's done well. But he's gave it straight back to Schweinsteiger. Can we get it back in? It's out to show. It's a good cross, and there's Wayne Rooney. He needed that goal. I don't think he's scored in his last two games. He, he's been on fire. But I don't think he scored against Wolfsburg, did he? No, did I even play him? I I'm losing track, but that's his ninth goal of the season anyway. He wasn't doing that well this game, and now he scored. 2-0, get in. A solid 2-0 win. Can't really ask for too much more. I'm happy with that. That's three wins in a row this episode, so we're doing very well. We're still fourth, and we're still seven points off leaders Arsenal. But we're starting to get a little bit of a gap. West Ham are on the same points as us, but Southampton are four points below and City even lower. So, you know, we're doing well. Let's just keep this up. Haha, <laughs> I got manager of the month. I think that's deserved, to be honest. If you look at that, that's actually, what, nine goals, no goals conceded as well in the Premier League. And we've had two huge games against Man City and Liverpool. So I think I deserve that manager of the month. Right, with qualification virtually sealed, I'm giving a few opportunities here and there. We've made some wholesale changes. We've got Valencia coming in with Daily Blind as well. Phil Jones has done very well. His fitness is high, so I'm going to keep him there. We've also brought in Fellaini, Lingard as well, Ashley Young. So yeah, we're giving some starts to players that don't usually start. So we might lose this one, but to be honest, I'm not too bothered because qualification... He's basically assured all we need is a point in this game or in any game that follows. So, yeah, I'm not too bothered, but obviously I want us to win. First chance of the game here, is it? Come on, Schneidlin. That's out to Lingard. Can he get it in? That's a penalty. I don't think it was a penalty, but I'll take it. It says Lingard's dive, but, you know, is that going to be him sent off? Because he's only yellow. Nope. Is it... Yep, he's off, so that's a red card as well. Lingard's dive to win us a penalty. Come on, Waza, score this for your 10th goal, is it, of the season? Yes, get in. 10 0, 1 0, 10th goal for Waza, get in. Oh shit, we've let them get an opening, and that's a fantastic save from David De Gea. Come on, they're down to 10 men, lads. And they've had another chance, fucking hell. Right, we've got another chance here, I think. Schneidlin, Carrick, Valencia, Young, good play, and that was an easy save. I don't know if that was a cross or a shot, but... Oh, well. Got another chance here. Corner. It's 
blocked, Schneidlin. Can he get it down? That's another red card, I think. Oh my god, I think Wolfsburg have went down to nine men. Yes, they have. Wow. Yes, they did go down to uh, nine men, but we've kept another clean sheet and we've qualified now. That's 12 points. We virtually have actually won the group we only need to get a draw against Sevilla to ensure that but we definitely have qualified and that was the minimum expectation so get in right can we make it five wins out of five for this episode i'm gonna return to a 4-2-4 we are against villa and we are away so maybe this is risky because i am going attacking they are doing well in the league I uh, think they're somewhere about 6th, 7th or 8th, somewhere up there. But anyway, here's the team lineup. I think it's fairly strong that Herrera-Schweinsteiger partnership worked in the last Premier League game. I'm happy with the defence as well. We haven't conceded in a while. Keeping the front four similar as well. So let's go for this and make it five wins from five for the first time this series. Oh shit, Villa have a chance here. That's a good save by De Gea. Thank God we've got him. He's as good on this as he is in real life. Villa all over us here. <laughs> Honestly, we really need to defend a bit better. Like, Come on, we've got a chance. It's our first of the game and it's the 67th minute, so that's kind of embarrassing. But can we make the most of it? It's young. I've subbed him on and that's a good save by Guzan. Fuck. Come on. Oh, thank God Villa shooting shit. Honestly, they've been all over us this game. Well, that wasn't the most ideal result, and I'm going to tell them that that was not good enough, but we're still fourth, and that just puts us a little bit further back from top. We still haven't lost this episode, and we still haven't conceded. Now, that's a key. So, who is our next fixture, actually? We've got Spurs next. Now, that is going to be crucial, because they're second, and if we lose that, we go far too far behind at this stage in the season so i'm gonna sim up to that game and then we'll look at the table more in depth the schedule and things like that and then we'll end the episode off right so a look at our schedule etc so we've had a brilliant run of form actually we've had successive i think eight wins but five in the premier league with uh, three in the champions league and then obviously that nil nil draw against villa next episode We've got the closure of the Champions League. Obviously, we're already qualified, but can we win the group? We should be able to. We've got Tottenham, Sevilla, Leicester, Southampton, and PSV. So, a fairly... I'd say it's bordering on the difficult side of an episode. Um, unfortunately, though, uh, we've got a couple of injuries to contend with. Luke Shaw got injured for England for three to four weeks and Daily Blind for the Netherlands. That's only a light injury, though, two to five days. So, we'll have to deal with those. But, all in all, very happy with this episode. We're fourth... We're nine points off the top, but uh, yeah, we, we definitely need to beat Spurs to be four points off them. And uh, yeah, make sure we cement that position in the top four. So hopefully you have enjoyed. Like the video if you have. No, subscribe if you haven't already. Like the video and yeah, peace.